Yo, welcome back. Zykor here, along with Trizen. And today in Ark, um, we were going to try and go and get that uh, max level snow owl that I found in the last episode. Um, it looked like it was pretty cool. It was a nice green and, of course, max level. Actually, it wasn't just a snow owl. It was an R snow owl, which is kind of even a little bit better because I think they get the extra levels yeah something like that um so uh yeah it's pretty cool so we're gonna go try and tame that let's see here uh no wrong button now i think um i think we have enough trank oh no i don't have enough trank arrows i've only got five trank six trank arrows i need to make more trank arrows um let's see here do we have and oh, we have some narcotics i will just make myself 50 trank arrows just because um let's see here so make myself 50 of them. There we go. Looks like we need to make some narcotics too. So we'll have to do that. Uh, otherwise, and we should just be able to tame it with some prime and stuff. But we'll see. I think I'm going to take out the Desmodus. Because I can fire from the back. And um, I can, you know, uh, fly after it if it flies off. Um, yeah, we could use the Griffin maybe, but uh, I think I'll just use my Desmodus. Then we can use a Sanguine on it too. But uh, if we're going to get Prime, uh, I, had, I do have my Drake, so I'll probably use that. Now I'm just waiting for Trank Arrows, which I'm starting to run laps around the base, which isn't good. <laughs> no, running laps actually is good for exercise. Uh, let's see, do I have any junk on me? I have narcotics, uh, of course, I already knew that. Uh, I'll put the narcotics back, now that those are done. There we go. So now I have 55 drank arrows, which is a lot better than just the five uh, or six I had before. So uh, let's see, I think the snow owl was somewhere up in that direction or over there, something like that. So I um, guess, how are you Voldemir? Uh, he has enough food and blood packs, so yeah, I'll just take him out here and we'll see. Now, I'm just going to probably net the snow owl if I can. Hopefully, I'll be able to. Now, I think it might have been up here. So let's get up here a little bit farther so I can be at a higher level to see it. It's also possible that I forgot where it was, too. Let's head over here. Could even be up a little bit farther. Of course, I could reference my own video as well. Let's get up higher. tries and decided to take his wyvern. Let's check over here. This is Giga territory. Now I know there was a red one there with it. There's Andrew Sarkis there. I'm pretty sure I was... Oh, wait. Wait, there's a red snow owl. Let's see. What about these? That's a yellow one. That's a 55. Um, what about that one? That is a very colorful one, but it's only level 60. Did I look at that one? Yeah, that was the yellow one. Okay. I know there was a green one. I can't fully remember if it was right here or elsewhere. But it's here somewhere. At least it should be here somewhere. Let's see if it's up here farther. Never know. Uh, there's something else. One of the AC2 animals.
Just looking around here. I thought it was over here somewhere, but you know, it's possible that it could have disappeared as well. So let's see. Yeah, there's Argies. Hey, there's just Sabertooth. That's a cool colored Sabertooth. Only level 20. Of course. Let's head over here. I'm pretty sure I wasn't this far over. But I'll head over here a little bit farther and see. Let's get over here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I wasn't this far over, so it must, I must either be missing it, and maybe it's back there or something. Because I'm pretty sure it wasn't here. The most likely case is that I forgot exactly where it is, so I might have to re reference my own video. The feeling when you actually have to reference your own video to remember where something was. So, um, yeah, I might just have to look where it is and be back. Although that looks really looks like the red one. So who knows? Maybe it's just in this area, but flew off somewhere. I'll have to see. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is where they were and where I was in the last episode. So, unfortunately, it looks like they despawned. Nuts. <laughs> I wanted that one. Eh... Uh... I guess uh, that's the, the thing with Ark. When you see something you want, you better get it right away or it could despawn. But yeah, this this looks like the place. Um, I, it was battling. I think it was battling a dodo uh, when I saw it. So it could be because that's why it d despawned. But yeah, unfortunately, it's not here. So, um, I guess maybe we'll look around for some more snow owls. We'll see if we can find any that are higher level. Um, these ones over here were pretty low. I could just battle them. Let's see. Because snow owls are useful to have if you want, uh, like a healer, you know. Yeah, that's a level 95. And our snow owls are probably the best because, well, they're, uh, they get extra, extra bonus levels at, uh, when you get them up to max level. Come on, snow owl. There we go. Okay. Got that one. Trizen's getting this one. Now there's probably some others here. There's another one over here. This is that, I think that level 55 one. Uh, level 61. Oh, what level is the text I go? Just because. Uh, 120. Eh, it's still not that good. Let's get this one. There we go. Got that one. And gained a level. That's nice. Okay. So, look around for some more because this is a good spot for them here in Fjorder. I don't know if there's any more here or not. Another saber tooth. Okay, a 140 red saber tooth. And it looks like Trizen found um, a 145 Torbosaurus. Hmm, interesting. We might want to try to tame that.
Because why not? The question is, what does it take? I am not sure. Hmm. Because additional creatures. Two creatures are different than uh, regular creatures. Sometimes they take a lot more uh, arrows to take down. So maybe what I'll do is I'll quick look up to see what it takes to tame it. And then we'll be back here and we might tame that. Because uh, like I was just saying, tame stuff when you find it. So uh, yeah, be back in a minute. Okay, uh, looking at it, it looks like it's just a regular, regular tame. You know, a regular knockout tame. Uh, so I guess what I'm gonna do is try to knock it out and see how well this goes. I do have a magnifier. I, I hope. Yeah, I have a magnifier. Uh, it does say it's that you can use net projectiles on it, which is kind of cool. Uh, let's see. So let's try to get in to it. And use a neck projectile on it. There we go. And land. Okay. Uh, passive, just because. Now, let's start firing at it. Had to make sure I had trying arrows on. <laughs> I don't know how many this is going to take. And I better jump on my Desmodus before it gets up because it has uh, Venom. Which would be terrible. <laughs> okay, keep it. Just kind of keep it hanging around me. Yeah, you get poisoned. This is bad poison. Okay, so it's running. Get back here, you. I wonder if my net projectile would work again. Go that way. Yes, go that way. Okay, so... Let's try to use another net. Now I missed! And then I'm, I missed again. There we go. Get in close to it. Now I'm stuck on a tree. I didn't... Okay, fine. I just need one Trank Arrow, but, um... We'll see. Trizen's using his Magnifier. And... I tell you, Desmodus. Okay. Looks like it's actually out. Okay, Trizen says it's out. Desmodus, stop! I tell you. They, all they do is cling to walls. Thank you. Uh, it, it be, uh, the Desmodus can be kind of annoying when you're on a cliff face. Okay, so yes, it's finally out. I don't know how many that many that took us. Um, what? Trezen and I were firing at about the same rate. So... And I used... What? I think I used like 15 crank arrows myself so if we use 15 each it'd be about 30 is what it looks like and I gotta make sure I don't punch it so I guess what we need to do is just go get some I guess prime or mutton I'm not sure how effective each one's gonna be so I actually might prefer to go get mutton so maybe we'll do that 
We'll have to see. Uh, maybe uh, since Trison's got his wyvern, he can go find a sheep or something. So yeah, um, when we get some food, we'll we'll bring you back. <laughs> okay, we figured we'd just uh, try some prime on it because why not? But I'm gonna make a sanguine first because of course sanguine fairly useful to use on them. Okay, I'll put that in my inventory. There we go. And then I will take the uh, prime off of Trizen's wyvern. Oh, come on. Uh, um, uh, prime. It's all prime, of course. Uh, okay, so I will have to do it this way. Because that Yeah. Ooh, these don't have very long left on them either. So, uh, I'll have to get some regular meat out too. Yeah. Just grab those. There we go. And take this. Okay. Now I will put it on. Prime. Okay, 11%. Let's use the Sanguine. Okay. And I'll put the regular meat on just in case. Oh, okay. Okay, um, that was fairly quick. That That's pretty nice. Okay. <laughs> uh, so they don't actually take that much to tame. Let's see. Uh, I'll take this off. I don't need that anymore. Yeah, we didn't actually wait very long at all. We just went gathered some prime and that's it so pretty cool now I'll have to make their saddle um, I'll have to bring it back to base but um, it seems like they're like related to Megalosaurus or something um, but it looks like the features they have uh, make them like they have venom and stuff that can like destroy armor or something like that so I'll have to see Actually, you know, I could just cryo it and bring it back to base. That would be the better thing. But they're not exactly Megalosaurus because uh, they don't sleep during the day. That, so that's good. <laughs> okay, I will cryo this and get it back to base here. Oh, I didn't take anything off of it, but we'll see. Anything left? Yep. And not really stuff I need anyway, but uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a hoarder. So put this stuff on. That, that's going to expire. Okay, base is over this way. And, yeah, I guess I'll continue looking for some snow owls, too. But I want to take out this Torvo and see how it works. Uh, let's let's check that one. Uh, wait, 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 wait. That's a 140 R snow owl. Actually, that one's not too bad. I could take that down. Except not when it's by the Andrew Sarkis. Hmm. Maybe I will take that down anyway. Um, I'll bring this back to base quick. Base is just way over here. So uh, yeah, I'll maybe bring you back when I get there. Okay. Back at base. I'm going to send this out. There we go. Okay. So now I'm going to make a saddle for it. We'll see. Um... So it has like 7k health almost. Hmm. Lots of food, of course. Eh, not super good. I mean, the weight is like 770. I mean, that's maybe not too bad, but I would like it to be like a thousand. <laughs> but we'll see. I have no idea. I'm not a good judge of their stats. I'll just say that. Okay, so I'm going to make a saddle here. Let's get over here. I don't know if it's made in the smithy or not. To be honest, I've never tamed a turbo before. So... <laughs> first for me um let's see in here torvo and if i forgot to mention before torvosaurus is a creature from additional creatures too so that's why it's you know we got that mod so that's why it's here uh, okay so is that okay there we go so it's just made in the inventory and it's just fiber hide and ingot okay not bad actually Let's see. Honestly, I need to repair my gloves. 
So, let's see. Do we even have enough metal? Yes, we have enough metal. Where's my gloves? Oh, for a second I was thinking they disappeared. So, fiber, hide, and some metal. I don't need all of that, but... Gloves, where'd you go? There we go. Put those back on. Okay, craft this. Uh, I don't have enough hide, okay. Get another stack of hide. There we go. Just wait for it. And <laughs> there we go. Takes long enough. Okay, put this stuff back in. I don't need that. And then I will equip it. Let's get over here. Since he's, yeah, far away. You know, I probably should have put him on the beach, but, uh, oh well. There we go. Now it's got a saddle. Let's see how fast they are. Eh, not bad. They're okay. Let's see how fast they swim. Oh, okay, they can f walk in, you know, a good amount of water. Okay, let's see what they do for damage. Now, let's see. I think they have... I think it's just a, like a left click and a right click. So this is the left click. Okay, what about right click? Okay, so that's a roar. What about C? Nothing. X? Nothing. Not Z. No. Control. Okay. Okay, so all they really have is a left click. Is what it seems like. Let me just... Let me check on my... On the wiki page here. Because that seems weird. Okay, yeah, that is it. Just a left click bite. Which inflicts high tier venom. And right click roar. But they're immune to venom themselves, and they can turn in place, which is a little awkward, but it might work. So, it needs a pretty good uh, damage boost. What level is that, turtle? Level 50, okay. Don't need you, turtle. So, um, yeah, it's a kind of a cool animal. Actually, what's that one? Is that a mega raptor? Yeah, it is a mega raptor. But it's only level 25. Nice colors, though. Kind of cool. Equus. What level is this Equus? Because I'm open to any dino, any animal. But that's only a level 60. Galley. Except for galleys, I mean, is that a low level galley? I didn't even see the level. <laughs> okay, let's head over here. That, what? I should check that. Uh, Tyranno Titan. I don't know if I want to be hit by that, but it's level 95. It's lower level than this thing. But I feel like it's getting beat up by a carbo. Okay, well, let's just. Come on. Okay, that didn't actually seem all that powerful. So that's, that's good in a sense. I didn't want to get this Torbo <laughs> killed as soon as I got it. <laughs> That would be terrible. Okay. Let's see. Now, Trison had seen a 150 Megalodon as well. In the water. Not too far away. Where's that snow owl, I wonder? Probably somewhere over there. 
And that concavenator is level 25. Okay, that's actually beatable. Concavenator, goodbye. I do think this thing needs probably some increased damage. Its damage is actually pretty low. Only 162, I mean, I think my crossbow almost does more. Okay. What else is here? Let's roar at this Tyrannosaur. Okay, he's unaffected by that. Okay. It can't even take a Tyrannosaur out before it flies. Okay. <laughs> That's unfortunate. What's that? Is that another Torvo? That is another Torvo, a level 90 Torvo. Okay. Oh, is that the, the... Is that the Snow Owl? Where is it? There we go, that's the level 140 Snow Owl. Let's take out this Torvo. And possibly take down the Snow Owl. Supposedly, according to Wiki, you can take out your weapon on the back of the Torvo, so let's see. Come on, Torvo, go down. You're not you're not wanted. So Torvo battling another Torvo is is uh a little slow. <laughs> okay, so is there anything here that could aggro on a snow owl? Technically I could take the snow owl down now. Um there's that Sabertooth, which is 85. Okay, so let's see. I can take out a weapon. Okay, that's nice. Let's see. Well, I'm going to take this snow owl down and just try to tame it because, yeah, why not? And why is it? Okay, there we go. Okay, let's... Come on. There we go. It's gonna take about 12. Or so. It's about 8. Nine, ten, eleven, and that would be twelve. Let's check it with the magnifier if I can. Uh, is it going to get up before it goes down? We'll see. I don't want to take it out either. Come on, come on, go down. Yes, there we go. There we go. Okay. So now, um, I'll just go gather some prime, which I have some. Okay, not bad. Um, I might want to try to protect this, though. There's a, I mean, I guess I could just stand around here. I, I got to make sure I don't uh, step on it. Who knows what it's going to do. Okay. I have some prime, though. So, yeah, actually, this wouldn't be too bad. So I could just take the prime off. Throw it on it. Oh, I don't have I don't have my Desmodus to use Sanguine. I guess Trizen's coming with his Desmodus. <laughs> don't come running next to my my s Snow Owl, you stupid things. Okay, I'm taking you down because you ran past my Snow Owl. There we go. Okay, hopefully it didn't hit it. Okay, let's see. I'll take this prime. And I will make... Actually, I'll make a sanguine first. Because that's the better thing to do. So make one sanguine. Take that. There we go. And I will take the prime. Okay. Make sure I... Don't punch it, because I have a habit of doing that. Okay, so prime. There we go. Put that on. 
use the sanguine. Which I don't even know if I had to, but I did anyway. Okay, so uh, that was up quick. That's good. Now we got a nice uh, 209 arsenal owl. Not bad. And it looks like Trizen found a 140. Um, okay, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna cryo this one up. Take all of that, because why not? And go take down the one that Trizen just found, because it's another 140 that looks exactly like this one, but it's a male, which is actually fairly nice. Take this out. There we go. No, stop! Oh, nuts. Well, <laughs> uh, it's getting damaged. Nuts. It's getting damaged by the poison. Hopefully it doesn't last after it goes down. I should have put the Torbo on, on passive. Trizen's looking at it with his magnifier. Looks like the Venom is gone. And I won't be able to trank it, trank it anymore either. Okay. And that's all I can do because it's nearly dead. I don't know how many I got into it. Um, hmm. I don't know if I hit it after it went down. That's a problem. So, uh, we'll see. Uh, okay. I might as well make another Sanguine. Because why not? And then I will put the Prime from the Torvo on it. There we go. Hopefully I didn't hit it afterwards. Oh, I have the Prime. Oh, nuts. We might have to go get more Prime. Um, let's see. I don't know if that's going to last enough. I forgot to put it on the, on the Torvo. Well, um, Prime. I'll put it on it, and then we'll have to go get some more. Oh, I didn't. Okay. Use the Sanguine. Okay, so hopefully that'll be done soon. Uh, I should probably put some regular meat on it, just in case. There we go. Uh, it might get done. It might. It's got three minutes. It should eat once or twice more. So that's good. Hopefully, as long as I don't punch it, because I have a habit of doing that. <laughs> it's the second time I've said that. <laughs> yes, I have a habit of punching things in Ark, because, uh, yeah, I... I just click <laughs> a lot of times. <laughs> okay. There we go. Okay, that's good. That's good. The sanguine elixirs, they work magic. Okay. So, this is another one. This is good. This gives us a nice breeding pair. They're 140, but uh, still, it's not too bad. Okay. So, um, technically, I could say we did what we were going to do at the beginning anyway, because we tamed two snow owls and a torvosaurus. Not bad. Take that. There we go. Okay. Now, just put all this on my Torvo, even though it's going to expire. Okay. Now, I have to get back. Bring this the snow owls back. I should make some snow owl... Uh, snow owl saddles as well. But now we can breed snow owls, so that's good. It's a good, uh, good thing to have because um, snow owls are great for healing. And then uh, the turtle is coming in because turtles are evil. Trizen's Desmodus is doing more damage than the Torvo. This Torvo really needs attack power. Okay, that was a 140 turtle, but. Not too many people want turtles anyway. Yeah, honestly, I'm not that interested in turtles. I've never really tamed one. Maybe we should sometime. Try some dropping packages. Okay. 
So, um, th yeah, this was actually a nice taming spree here in this episode. Uh, let's see that concavenator. It's red. That's a 55. Okay. We don't need a red level 55 concavenator. And I want to stay away from the Bronto just because because the Bronto would just be a pain in the butt to take care of. Okay. Heading down here. I guess I'll head back to base, but otherwise, that's probably it for this episode. Got a, a nice amount of tames here. Actually, yeah, it was some nice finds. Um, Trison found that 150 Megalodon. I almost feel like we should tame that too, but... <laughs> I don't know. I, we probably have to do that next time, but who knows if it'll be there. I don't know. It might disappear. But, um, yeah. That's it for this episode. If you like this episode, hit that like button. I really appreciate it. It really helps us out a lot. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that bell icon, leave a comment, and of course share it. And yeah. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. And this Torvo is actually kind of cool. Like I said, according to the lore, it's related to Megalosaurus. But it, the downside is that it just doesn't have enough attacks. So, yeah. Oh well.